So you watch the video on the bicep curl. Now we're going to work the tricep, which is kind of the opposite of the bicep. What we want to do here again is work the posture. And so first thing we're going to do is I got fairly light weights. I'm going to stick my butt out like I'm skiing. My chest is high, shoulders back. What I don't want to see is that rounding. From here, we're going to pace the elbows to the side, extend going back. Slow coming in, extend coming back. Now this is a simple tricep kickback. Again, working our posture, working our core, also working the tricep. Three, two, one. Probably the most common way to do the tricep in the gym is to use an attachment like this. Now again, we want to really perfect the ordinary with posture. I want you to get your feet together, chest is high, a little bit of hinge at the waist, elbows to the side, slow coming up, explode going down. Slow coming up, explode coming down. Again, I'm not flailing, I'm using the core, I'm using my posture, and this isn't just training my tricep, again, it's focusing on posture. Three, two, one. Just like the bicep uh, video, we're gonna use a long pulley, long attachment. Again, kicking our butt out, similar to that tricep kickback, except now my palms are up, and I'm working a little different part of the tricep. Three, two, one. Again, when we think about exercise, sometimes we get so focused on the movement and what muscle it's working. I like to think about exercise. How can I work the entire body while doing something like a bicep curl or tricep movement? See you again next time.